Everything you need to know about renting a kimono in Japan, part one. Number one, renting a kimono is actually very common in Japan, especially in cities like Kyoto. But not all rental stores are created equal, so make sure you go to one that is popular with the locals for the most authentic service. Number two, you get to choose your kimono color and all the accessories that go with it. So have a think about what colors or patterns you might like before you arrive, and it'll make things a little bit easier. Most Japanese people tend to go for more muted tones or lace, but you can always go for bright colors like I did. It's completely up to you. Number three, the rental shop will usually store your shoes, your clothes, bags while you explore in your kimono. Now, you won't have any pockets, but you can rent a matching bag for essential items like your phone and your wallet. Stay tuned for part two.